Hi, this is a tutorial on how to organize your digital photos on the computer. So the first thing we're going to do is open up a new folder and you can do that by either going to the bottom taskbar and uh, clicking on the folder icon or going to the start button and selecting pictures. So next we're going to create two new folders uh, within my pictures. So the first one is going to be called one.unsortedphotos. Just click enter to create that. And then the second one, so the way that you create a folder is going up on the blue bar here and click on new folder. And the second one is photos. Then we're going to go ahead and open two.organize photos and you do that by double uh, clicking on it. And we're going to create the um, categories that we came up with in the workshop. So these are the main folders, uh, the broad categories. They can be around occasions, family, work, hobbies or just date related come up with uh, categories that make sense to you and we want them to be quite broad if you are going to follow my suggestion of having subfolders within that. So once again create new folders and mine are trips. Whoops, if you accidentally click the wrong button and it just says new folder you can uh, just click on it and still name it. So Earth. So we really don't want more than six broad categories, otherwise it becomes too confusing. So after we've created those folders, we want to go back into My Pictures. So you can do that by either clicking the back, back button or just up here clicking Pictures. Then we're going to go ahead and open one unsorted photos and we're going to upload our first device on into that album. Once we've done that, we want to change the view so that we can see what the photos are of. And you do that once again on that blue bar at the top, you will see this kind of icon and a little drop down um, arrow. Click on that and it will come up with some options. So we're going to select details. Now just note this changes every time we change the view, that little icon changes. So depending on what view you were on, you might see something else there. So now we've got it in details, you can see we've got all these columns here and we're just going to click on the top date button because that's going to put it in order. Now it's either going to put the newest to the oldest or the oldest to the newest. If you want it the other way around, just click date again and it will do that. So now we've got them in date order, we want to change the view to extra large icons so that we can see what our pictures are of. So as you can see, my main issue is always taking pictures of my dogs. Okay, so next we're going to reduce this folder down and you do that on the very top right hand corner. There is these two squares here. If you click that it will reduce it down and you can simply move it around by uh, left clicking and holding your mouse down and it will move around. So now we're going to open up a second folder. So once again on start bar we're going to open up pictures again and we're actually going to open the identical folder that we've already got open. So one dot unsorted photos. We're going to grab the uh, blue bar and put it beside it. Now to resize you can either grab a corner and then it will go up and down and you can also grab the side. So once you see those two little arrows you can make it bigger or smaller. So we want to be able to see both folders easily. So I've now got two views of one unsorted photos. 
one in extra large icon and one in list. So now we're going to look at the photos we have and we're going to create a new folder um, following our uh, naming convention, naming policy, whatever you want to call it. So I can see this is of my pets. So on the right hand view here, we're going to click new folder and create a folder. So my naming convention, I'm going to do PR for per dash pets dash Jesse and Rocky. Now please note it does make a difference on how they're going to be ordered. Decide whether or not you want gaps between the words and um, little symbols because that makes a difference on how it gets sorted. So once you've done that you can click off it and then we're simply going to drag any photos that relate to that new album over. So you can do that by putting your cursor over a photo, left clicking and then dragging, that's one way. Another way is um, putting your cursor on the top left hand corner of a photo, left click on your mouse and then drag and as you drag it will select the photos that your cursor goes over. Once you've done that, you can simply once again drag them over. Another way is um, clicking on a photo and then clicking your control button. So holding your finger down on your control and then selecting the photos that you want. And you can also drag multiple ones over by that way. So we're going to go through and if you see any evident really quick photos that you want to delete, delete them. So these are both identical, I can quickly delete them, but that is not the um, not what we're concentrating on at the moment. We're just concentrating on sorting them, so don't take too much time doing that. Just keep scrolling as the new photos are as the photos are filed. Sorry, new photos will appear, and you can see if you need to create a new album, do so, and then just keep going through your photos. So I know that these are all my dog photos, so I'm just simply going to move them over. So once you've been through, you're likely to have a lot more albums and you will see a view like this. There will be no more uh, photos just loose. They will be all in albums. Once you've done that, you then upload your next device and go through the same process until you've been through every device that you own. Once you've done that, um, you double click on um, the album to open it up and then make the screen bigger by clicking on that square at the top, maximize. And we want to go through and declutter the photos. So look for any double ups and delete them. Once we've gone through, we've got rid of all of our double ups. If you need to, you can change the view again to date, make sure they're in date order, um, especially if you've been through and uploaded multiple devices, it's no longer going to be in date order. Do that first and then change it back to extra large icons here and start deleting. Once you've deleted them all, you can then um, rotate any photos of the other wrong way around and you do that by right clicking and then go down and either rotate clockwise or counterclockwise. So I'll do it on this one, clockwise, and it puts it the right way around. So go through all your photos, deleting any double ups. Once we've done that, we want to um, reduce this album down again. Once we've done that, we're going to change the view to list and go back one folder so that we're in one dot unsorted folder and we will have a list of our folders here. On a separate uh, screen, we're then going to open up two dot organized photos and we're simply going to drag the folder from the left hand side 
into the relevant folder. And you can see as I've gone over Perth that it's highlighted and I can drop it and it's gone in there. I can double click and check that it is in there and you would keep going until you have filed all your um, new folders from one dot unsorted into two dot organized photos and that is it hope it helped if you have any questions please email me at support at the organizing school dot com thanks